Hey there, Lupter here, and welcome back to our Hardcore Swar World. It has been a little while since I've been on this world, I do apologize for that. Uh, but I do remember what we were going to be doing. Uh, one of the main things that I want to do is get started on like a little raid farm in a sense. Not exactly like a proper farm, but an area we can do raids at without having to like go all the way up a mountain, down a mountain like we've been doing and just... Ah, so much work with that. So I want to make something like that. I'm thinking about making it like over there towards the ocean area. So that way it's like wide open. We can build upon it when we need to. That sort of stuff. Now, as far as other stuff goes, I do want to start making some strength potions just so that way we can like properly do these trial chambers like on the omen setting so that way we can like instantly kill everything because we kept on getting our butts whooped last episode and then after that i think we should do some building you know start making things look nice around here like make the inside of our house look better maybe add like a windmill or some other stuff over there just a whole bunch of other stuff but like i said first things first we're gonna start working on a little raid area so let me kind of just clean up this shulker box and my inventory up a little bit here now i do have a mending book we should probably use that on our axe here because we don't have mending on it uh any iron left over yes perfect okay uh something like this for two three blocks of iron and then we finish it off with an anvil there we go uh let me place it right here do this this and there we go all right let's get on well actually let me grab a bed first because it's about to be nighttime. but let's get on moving to an area where we can get a lot of grass at because i don't want to i don't want to be using all the grass around here oh yeah we should probably take down this little mob farm i'm thinking i'm thinking for the little like raid area we should build it like about here i think that would be pretty good area but like I said, we need to get a lot of dirt and probably a lot of stone. I want to make it kind of look a little homely so that way it's not just like a giant dirt platform. Okay, I think this area right here, this jungle area, is a good area to get some dirt at. I'm not really gonna not really gonna build in this jungle because of the fact of how small it is. So I think this should be a pretty good area to get a lot of grass, dirt, all that sort. Now we should also start looking into fighting the weather here soon, because I wanna get what do you say? I want to get some beacons up and going in order to just instantly mine stuff. So I think that would probably be something I might look into today. But I'm not entirely sold on it. We'll see. We'll see how things go when it comes to building the uh, building the little raid arena. And then we'll do it if it's like a good idea or not. You know, I should probably get them breaking on this shovel because it's already almost broken. Which thankfully we have mending, but still we need them breaking so we don't have to worry about this so often. So let me collect the last remaining pieces of like dirt and grass and then we'll just kind of pack up our stuff and go because I don't think, I don't think we really got too much in this shovel. Thankfully though, we're almost to a full stack of shulkers. Sadly, I do know we're going to need a lot more for like the size I'm thinking for it. So we're going to have to kind of do like a back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. But for now, not, not too bad. Now, I do believe, yep, there it is. I was about to say, I believe my nether portal to my XP farm should be right here, which it was. So going to kind of do a quick heal here. Wait, man, what am I doing? I can just do this. So much easier, so much easier. You know, I'm not going to lie, completely forgot I turned off hostile mob sounds. But it's probably a good thing to leave it off for now, because I really don't want to don't wanna listen to all these pigmen. Alright, our shovel is almost there. About one more swing. There you go. Uh, let's work on our axe, and then finish it off with our pickaxe. Alright, our axe is complete. Moving on to the pickaxe. There we go. I knew it wasn't going to take long for that. Anything else? Nope, does not seem to be. I'm going to just throw away everything else here, and throw down. Okay, that could have been bad there. Not going to lie. That could have been a little bad. But thankfully, we have our elytra and a totem of undying. So, should anything happen, we should be at least a little bit safe there. Ooh, hang on. We got a little traveling villager here. What do you got? What do you got for sale? Anything good? Uh, not really. Gunpowder is pretty cool, but I really... I don't need that. We got a uh, gunpowder farm right up there. So... I'm gonna leave you alone. So you have a good day, sir. All right, let's see. I think about here should be a pretty good area to start off with as far as the whole building a uh, little battle arena goes. So I'm gonna quickly get some dirt out now so that way we can just get this started. Break you and let's kind of pillar upwards. Now I will be honest, I want this to be pretty big. So I'll probably do like a stack and a half in like each direction here. 
and then just kind of like curve it around make it a big old circle just to give it that little bit of detail so it's not like just a giant square platform so let's get started one two three oh you know what i just realized we can make this kind of like multi-purpose where we can have other stuff here as well so that way we don't have just like a battle arena it can be like a tree farm or even a normal farm have like a bunch of villagers wandering around i don't know something like that uh, I'm kind of thinking back to, like, Vintage Beef. He was, like, an old-school Minecraft player that I used to watch. And I remember ma uh, him making this giant lily pad thing with a bunch of, like, villagers and whatnot when, like, 1.4 came out, I think, or it was, like, 1.6 era. I can't exactly remember. But I remember watching him a lot, and, oh my god, I'm just having a lot of nostalgia right now. Now, we'll be honest, I know I said I was gonna do, like, a stack and a half. However, I think one stack should be more than enough, because, like, look at that. You can't even see the other end there. Plus, that should be about, like, 129 blocks from one side to another, so we should have more than enough space. Alright, we're almost done. Three, two, one. Bam, there we go. Yeah, now we just gotta make this kind of circular, and it should look, hopefully, hopefully start looking pretty good. But, uh, yeah, uh, got some grass here. I know that would be very useful for, like, the inside area, but I want to curve it. Oh, nope, that's not what I meant to do. I was trying to place down the shulker box, but I do want to curve it first. So let's get some dirt here, or, uh, not originally, but get some dirt here, and that should make this look a lot nicer. Now, I am thinking for this, we go about half a stack in each direction, and that should be more than enough as far as, like, getting a start to a curve going. Okay, so I used about a whole entire stack, so half a stack here, half a stack there. I don't think I'm going to go anything too fancy. It's just going to be like a natural curve. Just something like this. Don't want to go. Don't want to go too complicated, you know? Oh, you know what? We should probably start looking into getting some light sources here soon. Because we are about to fill up this whole entire area. So I think I should probably either make some torches or get some glowstone. So, let me see. Do we have... Oh, we got some torches. Never mind. Yeah, look at that. We got somebody here. You're not supposed to be here. Get out of here. Back, Creeper. Oh, let me back away. You're actually gonna probably kill me. Ah, oh, no. He blew it up. Damn it. Alright, I should probably sleep real quick. Let me do that. You know, I'm not gonna lie. I kind of underestimated how big this was gonna be. Because for some reason, I thought, you know... This is gonna be a pretty small build. Even though it's gonna be, like, big, it's not gonna be that big. No, I'm, uh... I'm a little bit mistaken here. Oh, you know what? I just realized we have the little, like, ocean monument down there. We could actually make something cool, like, going to and from, like, a little, like, I don't know, underwater tunnel. Oh, hang on. That would be super cool. We could have, like, an underwater tunnel and then, like, clear out the whole entire, uh, underwater section of the, uh, ocean monument. So that we can have, like, I don't know, do some cool structures there, trophies, I don't know, something, something. Oh, that's, like, fu future plans right there. Okay, I think i believe i've done all the round edges now it's just to fill in the inside here which i'm gonna need probably a lot more dirt because i think i used a good amount already here let me see yeah i kind of used a good amount here already uh no worries though no worries we can we can very easily take care of this i'm gonna like space out my dirt and grass so that way like kind of grows a little faster rather than just be like one big area of grass and then one big area of dirt this would probably be a lot faster if we focused on getting more so grass rather than dirt but eh oh well it's gonna turn into grass one way or another you know yeah we are definitely gonna need to get a lot more grass and dirt because holy i'm not even like a fourth of the way done not even like an eighth really yeah i think a good thing to do right now would be getting um breaking on the shovel if we're gonna need a lot of grass and dirt so, I'm gonna work on that. Gonna first take a quick snooze. Excuse me, Mr. Creeper. You're, uh, kind of next to my bed here. Gonna need to tell you to get away here. And one more shot to do it. There we go. Now, I know I could probably force a villager to give me unbreaking, but I really, I don't want to sit there at the, uh, at the whole lecturing and just go break, unbreak, break, unbreak. I'm just, I'm gonna be lazy here. Oh, I should probably have grabbed some more lapis just in case. Yeah. Yep. I knew it. I knew it was not gonna be that easy. All right. Take two, please. Ah, uh -huh. no, I don't need fortune two. All right, let's do a take three, and we got. Hmm, still not good. Still not good. Ooh, I'm breaking three. 
Oh, I was hoping for uh, efficiency 5 or 4 so that we can make it into 5, but that works. That works. I mean, it's a diamond shovel. It's not going to change much. Ooh, 19, 23. All right, all right. We got to go with 19. However, we should probably name this something. Uh, Excavator. I think that should be a pretty simple name. I think now. Excavator. Later. I think this is how you uh, spell it. Oh well, if it's not correct, it's not correct. I'm not. I'm not gonna be stressing over it personally. Yeah, this is a. Uh, this is a bit big here. That's what she said. Anyway, uh, let's kind of grab our shulker box and get on out here because we got a lot of grass and dirt to grab. Oh, you know what? I think we need to get some more saplings, like some more jungle saplings. So I'm going to grab it from this tree right here. <laughs> I already know this will not be enough grass and dirt, but I got to take what I got. Gotta take what I got. Okay, so looking at this, we need about like two shulker box worth of dirt and grass in order to take care of one, like one fourth of this area. So we are going to be doing a lot of back and forth here. But now that we know that, we should probably start grabbing a second shulker box just to make it a little bit easier on ourselves. All right, time to get another shulker box and then get another... Uh, Another two shulker box worth of dirt and grass. Now let's see, do we have a shulker box laying around somewhere? We should. We should. I think it might be over here, or did I leave it over at the creeper farm? I can't remember. I cannot remember. Ah, there you go. There's a shulker box. Uh, got a good amount of items in here, so I'm just gonna kind of empty it down. Just throw it in a random chest. I don't, I don't really have a system anymore. All right, there you go go two things empty let me go out and get some more dirt you know i just realized we have a trident where on earth did we get that from i don't remember i don't remember that did we get it from the trials i think we might have gotten it from the trials i don't know i can't remember Whew. there we go we got two shulker boxes worth of dirt and grass i'm gonna need to uh repair my shovel here soon but i'm gonna go fill in the area first kind of mess up my firework there but i'm gonna go fill up the area first and then we'll kind of repair my shovel and then rinse and repeat about like what two more times after this i don't know something like that yeah definitely gonna need to light up this area i mean look at all these creatures here look at that and there we go we have completed one fourth of this whole entire area that is whew, way too much that is way too much but we gotta continue. We gotta continue. Oh, look at that. We got a friend on our island here. What do you got for sale, buddy? Uh, nothing, nothing really cool. Just generic stuff. Actually, you know what? We could probably get some leads. I'm gonna get some leads here. Well, it is about that time again to go out and get a bunch of dirt. First things first, though, we will need to repair our shovel. So let me grab the shulker boxes and then make our way to the XP farm. Actually, before we go to the XP farm, I do want to make some more fireworks and then we'll make our way there because I am a bit out. Uh, we should have some gunpowder left over in some chests and then just break open the uh, sugar canes over there. All right, we got about half of this island complete. Now we just got to complete the other half, which is... Oh, I'm not gonna lie, it's taking a long while for this, but we gotta move forward. We gotta move forward. There we go. We got three-fourths of this area done. We just gotta finish up this last little bit of area, and we are all set and done with this stupid, uh, stupid idea I had to make a giant raid area. Now, I'm only saying that's stupid because of the fact that I've been working on this for about, like, two hours now. Well... There goes my bed and pretty much a good portion of this area. Ah, oh, finally, we are just about done with this boring, uh, boring part of this video of me just making a giant dirt grass platform thing. I don't even know what to call it at this point. We're done. We can finally start working on some cooler stuff. And I think the first thing I'm going to do is actually go to the nether. I want to kind of like farm out a bit of the uh, blaze rods. As well as like try to farm a little bit of the wither skulls. Just so that we can like fight the weather here soon. Maybe not this episode, but I do want to do it like within the next like episode or two type of thing. Now I will need to find my book that has the coordinates because i have no clue where i need to go for the uh what do you say put in their fortress ah there it is uh let me check yep that is 100 percent my book so let's go find the fortress and get some blaze rods and maybe 
maybe some wither skills and skulls so let's see negative 330 negative 230 i think it's this direction like out through here and in that direction yeah okay cool i'm actually gonna fly there because i'm kind of kind of a bit lazy right now and here we are back at the nether fortress gonna equip this and then take care of this stupid blaze that just shot me like come on dude i'm not supposed to do that uh can you get a little closer please Ooh. okay you shot me again uh, I should probably eat first before I go to fight him. All right. And, hmm, are we going to die? Probably. I'm not going to risk it. I'm actually going to jump down a little bit here because he should follow me. And bonk. Ooh. Parkour! Oh. <laughs> I completely missed that. I don't really need to go too crazy when it comes to blaze rods. So, yeah, that's... Oh, my God. That is way more than enough. Now, I will, like I said, try to get some wither skulls. At least, like, one more. Just that way I can have like a good even number here. Although it can be kind of challenging since Wither Skeletons do love to like not spawn sometime. So we'll see how long I'll last here. Ooh, look at that. We hit the Wither Skeleton jackpot. Please give me a skull, one of ye. One of ye, please. No skulls yet. Ah. You know, I kind of wish we had that one mod pack. I think it's like all the mods 10. Where they have like some type of mod that allows me to get like weather skeleton fragments and you can make like skulls out of that and that would be so useful right now because i'm not really seeing a lot of weather skeletons i'm hearing some i think yeah there you go because i'll be honest i am not seeing a lot of weather skeletons i hear a couple of them here and there and then just nothing for a long while so i might just head back home then since i'm not really finding much uh, I think I might have seen one more. Yeah, I see one back here. Let's see what you're gonna give me. Please give me something good. Ah, uh, okay. Well, I'm gonna head back home, try to make some potions, and then guess do the trials. So let me equip my wings, and off we go. All right, let's make some strength pots. Gonna throw some blaze powder. Or no, 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 no. Uh, we need to get some warts first. Do we have any chests nearby? Uh, might need to go down to our wart farm. Nope, we got some. Perfect. Okay, uh, so we throw some warts into here, and then we throw some blaze powder, and then, what was it again? It was glowstone. Glowstone makes it stronger. And then one blaze powder, and I have the glowstone dust right here, and we should be good to start a trial. Well, once I grab the uh, Omnis Potion from the village. And there we go. We got some strength pots. All right, let's go grab the stuff from the village. And we should be able to start a trial. All right, we don't really need to grab more than one. We do got some totems. That would be very useful for uh, when we get a lot of the like zombies and skeletons like killing us in one shot. But all right, let's go and start our trial chamber. Hopefully we can use like the previous ones that we did the whole uh the whole omen on but i doubt it i don't think we could but we will see where was it again it was somewhere somewhere over here ah there it is perfect all right let's go down and get started oh cool the uh trials reset that's pretty neat speaking of which i don't have proper armor on you know i probably should have brought some blocks but that's all right that's all right we don't really need some blocks at the moment I won't need to stop this water source, though. Like, come on. Get out of here. Get out of here, water. We don't need you. You know, I'm not gonna lie. I thought the breeze mob would be a lot more difficult than it was. But it's really, it's really not that hard. It's actually pretty easy to take, uh, take care of. All right. I think we're finally at that point where we need to try this out. We need to see how well this will go as far as the trial chambers go. And I think drinking a strength pot now would be very useful. So that we can just pretty much two-shot these guys. At least hopefully, like, two-shot them. Yeah, this was a pretty good decision on our end to, uh, get some strength pots. Because we are, we are starting to do a lot of damage to these guys. Pretty much just whopping their asses. Paired with the golden carrots that we got. Ooh, we are cooking, I tell you what. I will say, though, these, uh, these blaze rods, or what are they called? Oh, I can't remember their names. Uh, breezers. These breezers are super annoying. Oh, we completed one of the, uh, chamber things. I just heard the, uh, confirmation noise. I heard, like, a ding! Oh, we completed another one. Hopefully, hopefully, we got the key. <gasps> we got a key! Yes! Okay, so we have a chance. A chance. Not a big chance, but a chance to get the, uh, what do you say? Get the... Ah, crap. The mace. That's the name. Alright, you guys can stop shooting me. I'm kind of getting tired of being mollywopped a little bit here. 
Man, I would have taken care of these skeletons way before taking care of some zombies, because this is a lot easier with the uh, skeletonies. Worst they do is just make me a little slow, so don't have to don't have to worry about them like ganging up on me too much. All right, we still got one chamber still alive here. I'm going to kind of just shoot this guy down here. Not really going to worry so much about the uh, hole jumping down there. What do we get? Another key. Yeah, let's go. Uh, what are you? Are you a key thing or are you just a spawner? I think you're a spawner. We got a golden carrot and a normal key. Not bad, not bad. Uh, any, any areas we can loot? No, does not seem like it. Okay, so we do have that one key area down here that we can use. Bam! Alright, what do we get? What do we get? Please, please, please. Uh, breach charge arrow, and that looks like a type of pattern. I mean, that's okay, I guess. Not exactly what I was looking for. All right, we'll continue forward and see what else we can find. I think there's one in here. That's a uh, blue one. Yeah, okay. Let's use you. Please be good. Uh, Pattern, emeralds, and a crossbow. Okay, Uh, not exactly what I want, but I'll take the uh, banner pattern and the emeralds. Well, not banner, the uh, armor trim. All right, we should probably drink another potion here just to make this go by much faster because I don't... Again, I don't want to deal with these guys. Ooh, we got some steak. That's pretty cool. Uh, not really useful though, so I'll just kind of kind of hold on to it, but not really use it, I guess. Okay, this one, this one will give us a little bit of trouble if we don't uh, if we don't try to be careful here. Oh crap! I may have activated two of them. I really hope I did not just activate two of them. Yep, I activated two of them. Of course I did. Parkour. Ooh, okay. Yeah, definitely, definitely don't want to deal with that for now. I'm going to heal up first, and then we go back. I'm not going to lie, this is going a lot smoother than before. I don't know what's exactly different. I don't think it's just the strength, but I'm not really getting, I'm not really getting too damaged. I think it might be, you know what? It's definitely the uh, golden carrots. That's helping out a lot right here. Ooh, we got a regeneration potion. Pretty cool. Uh, I guess we'll take it. We got some more steak. I really... I need some more keys. That's the thing. I need keys. Not steak, not uh, carrots or anything like that. You know, I just realized something. I don't think you can use arrows against the uh, breezers here. I'm going to have to see this again because I think it's just ricocheted. Yeah, that looks like it just uh, either ricocheted or just went through it. Yeah, it ricochets. Okay, so you cannot use range attacks. That's pretty cool. Ah, oh, we got another potion. That's not exactly what I need. I'll take, but... Give me something good. Ooh, we got a bronze key one. Hang on. Uh, hey, let me try to do this key thing, please. Uh, bam. What do we get? Something good? Some arrows. Uh, chest piece. That's it. Damn. I will admit, we are starting to run a little low on golden carrots. Let me try to use the wind charge here. I never used it before. Uh, I think we can do something like this. No. Okay. <laughs> I have no clue how to use this, I'll be honest. Man, you just gave me baked potatoes. I don't want baked potatoes. Kind of strange that we have not gotten a key in a while. Then again, we got lucky with like two keys in a row, so... Ooh, more carrots. I will actually take that, I'm not gonna lie. Alright, this will be the last little area I'll be in for this stuff, because I don't think there's really gonna be much else I can do if I can't, you know, actually get any keys. Oh, I should probably drink my strength pot since we're already here and just use it against these guys. Man, call me the human porcupine over here because I am just filled with arrows. Oh, we got a key down there. Oh, I need that. I need that like yesterday. Throw, throw, throw. Okay, and then run because we are also poisoned and being shot by everything. Oh, we got another key. Yeah, that's what we're looking for. <gasps> Three keys. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. That's what I need. Oh, I need to eat this carrot as well. And then I should probably drink another potion of regeneration just to be safe here. Ah, we can use another one right here. Please, 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 please. Ooh, golden apple, diamonds, emeralds. Okay, you know what? I'm not that upset. I'm not that upset. Uh, what can we get rid of? Glass bottles. Oh, it's a notch apple. I thought it was a normal golden apple. Oh, that makes it even better. But uh, let's get rid of some arrows. We don't need we don't need all that arrows. Now there should be one in here if I remember correctly. So let me kind of just go through. What do we go through? It's like somewhere over here. Yeah, right here. Okay. Uh, let's go through here. Just break on through and use the key. Please give me the maze. Please, please, please. Nope. Nope. No. Ah. Uh, man, we are pretty much zero. What? 
five now well we do have one more but we do have that one area back over here if i remember correctly that we can use it on so we'll just go back here try it once more if it doesn't work it doesn't work and then i don't know we'll figure it out we'll figure it out or no this is a complete opposite area. <gasps> I know this area. Oh, no, 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 no. I know this area. Yeah, I'm just gonna stay up here real quick. I'm gonna use the key here. Okay, music disc. Hey, it's a new one. Hey, we got some new music. Let's go. Oh, boy. We are definitely in a world of hurt right now. I mean, all my health is pretty much gone again. Because these stupid zombies... Oh, Christ. Christ, 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 Oh, this is bad. 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 There you go. Oh, look at this strat. They can't get through the door and we can just kill them from above. I do want to know what this uh, music disc sounds like, though. I'm not going to lie. We shall figure that out once we get back home, though. Oh, we might be using a totem here soon. <gasps> uh, okay, okay, okay. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Fast, 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 fast. Up, 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 up. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Okay, now we're good. Whew. I'm gonna drink a potion of regeneration as well, just to be extra safe. I really wish we got, like, the weapons and or armor that they drop, because that would be so cool. I do understand why, though, because it would be a cheap way to get, like, diamond armor and tools, you know? But we should be pretty much done with these guys here soon. Like, there shouldn't really be too many more zombies. Yeah, okay. Uh, we got some potatoes. We got a key. Uh, don't know where he... Uh, blah. Don't know where we can use the key on, but we'll find a, uh, find a way. I think there might be something this direction as far as like a uh, area we can use a key on. I think up here, if I remember correctly. Let me see. Are you one? Yes, you are. Okay. Uh, bam. Please, please, please. Oh, oh we did it. Oh, and a block of emerald. Oh my god. 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 Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. This is... Ooh. Don't freak out. Don't freak out. Stay calm. Stay calm. I think it's a heavy core and a breeze rod together. Kind of like this. <gasps> yeah. Oh my god. Let's go. Oh, we gotta use this. We gotta use this. Okay, we got some we got some targets from here. We got some targets from here. Alright, justice. Range from above. Bam! Oh, that's so cool. Oh, that's so cool. I do know the higher you uh fall from, the more damage it does. But we are not in that good of an area to do that in. Alright, we're getting out of here. We're getting out of here. We don't really need to be down here anymore. Oh, this makes me so happy. We finally got it. Now, I will be completely honest. I'll probably not use the mace that often. But I still want to try, like, some cool stuff. Like, I don't know. Trying to hit the ender dragon with it. That would be pretty cool. Or maybe the warden. Although, I think I pretty much got rid of all the spawns. So, we gotta find, like, a different ancient city. But, like, man. That is... Oh, that is so lucky. Because I think it's, like, a very low chance. It's, like, I could be mistaken. I like, a 7% chance or, like, a 2.7. Something like that. I think there's a 7 in there, at least. But, yeah, I'm intrigued to know what this music disc will sound like. Because the other one was, like, a lullaby type of thing. Like, a lullaby box. And this one says creator. So, I'm intrigued to know what that will sound like. Because, again, I haven't really, like, listened to much of the uh, newer music of Minecraft when it comes to music disc for, like, 1.21. So, kind of out of the loop here. I will be honest, I am intrigued to see what they're going to do for, like, 1.22 for the music disc. Alright, here we go. Let's listen to this song. Oh, it's also a music disc. Pretty cool. Not gonna lie, I'm liking this one a little... Oh, hang on. Oh... Okay, okay. I was about to say, I'm liking this one a little better because it has, like, a little more to the music, uh, to, like, the lullaby part of it, like, the lullaby box. But this is, this is a whole different tune right here. It kind of reminds me of, like, a waltz of some kind type of beat, like a Cinderella movie, uh, where they just dance in the courtyard back and forth, something like that, you know? But yeah, I'll be honest, I can get down with this. Like, don't get me wrong, it's not, like, the rest of the music disc. But it's, like, super unique compared to what we got, you know? Now, I will let that play out. Uh, pretty much gonna end off the episode here. I know I said I was gonna make a windmill, but after spending a couple hours making that stupid dirt platform, I'm just, I'm kind of cronked out a little bit here, so I kind of want to just take a quick snooze, edit this video, and then start recording more videos for you guys with other game series like RL Craft, uh, Dragon Ball Sparking Zero, Call of Duty, that sort of stuff. So yeah, if you guys did like the video, please like, comment, subscribe. And without the way, this has been Lothar20, signing off. Bye-bye.